this looks like. Wow. Do you have the brake on? Because he has a lot of work right now. So do and I. you're the you're my so go-to guy. So do you're I. my go-to guy. So Me child, let me see your face. <laughs> I love you. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the vlog. Thank you for tuning in today. We're gonna be discussing uh, what's going on with Little Blue. I hit a pothole, yeah, I did. Um, so hard that the control arm literally popped. Are you editing too? You want me to show you? Uh, I made this video for the last seal. So yeah, I hit a pothole and uh, the control arm for Little Blue snapped. Just like the tree out back in my backyard snapped too. So bad, I need some coffee. Check this out guys, look how interesting this looks. Wow. Not even an inch on the seat. Not even touching it. There's not even a branch touching it. Look at that. Whoa. Oh. Pretty cool. All right guys, so yeah, that's today's plan. We're gonna be taking a little blue to Orlando, dropping her off getting it fixed tomorrow hopefully and picking up some c-notches for the c10 at the setup so here we go guys i wanted to drive it out there but the way it's looking right now i'm not gonna risk it i literally drove this truck to Conroe and back like maybe 35 minutes out there and coming back not noticing that the control arm was kind of f***ed up yesterday And I was thinking you know what? I think I can make it all the way to Orlando's place without you know Without the truck But I don't want to end up like that So I'm gonna get someone to tow the truck all the way over there because the way it's looking it, I don't really want to risk it just in case something does happen Blessed by God or something that I made it back home safely without even noticing anything because I noticed it when I got off of when I went to go get some fast food and came back and I was like man it sounds like the brakes and then I went down there and it wasn't the brakes it was the control arm but guy was on my side because check this out You always come for the rescue. Always, bro. Always. My homeboy Jose. How you doing, man? Jose. You want to check it out? Go underneath that truck and look at the control arm. Oh, it came off. Oh, crap. Wow, but damn. It broke in half. Se le quebró. Yeah. You hit something or what? I hit a freaking bottle. A bottle? Yeah. A pothole. Oh, a pothole. Yeah. Houston streets yeah. ain't nothing to play with when it comes to these potholes. So, uh, we're gonna load it up and take it to Orlando. All right, we're gonna have to load it up from the front then. Yeah. Because if not, it's not gonna make it out of here. Clean, bro, you have it all clean too. <laughs> not so long ago, there was a debris, like a, a plywood, like a little plywood hit the front of my truck. So I gotta get a new light because it's letting water in now. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you can oh, even, right here. Yeah, you can even see that little debris right there Damn. still in there. Hit it right here and hit it right here. Scrape it a little bit. Let's load it up real quick, Doc. Yes, Doc. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Yeah. It could have been worse, bro. I went to Conroe and back, not knowing about that. Yeah. It is what it is, guys. Might not show, but I am positive. 
Just my face expression ain't gonna show it that much. Finally here guys, finally here at Orlando's shop. Every time my truck breaks down, he's always the one that picks it up. Which one is it bro? Uh, that one over there. Let me call him, because he this doesn't one, even look like he's right here. here. Yeah, doesn't even look like he's here. Hey, I'm at the shop. Yeah, bro, where you at? You drove it or what? Yeah, I drove it. Yeah, man. <laughs> I'm here. And it sounds like a D. For some reason, my truck sounds like a diesel right now. Yeah, it's starting to sound like a diesel. You hear that? <laughs> Just about to stay here for the night. Woo! Huh? Yeah, I already put it on park. I guess I'm gonna have to drive it and put it here somewhere. Shout out to John John because man, this man always comes for the rescue every time. First time he picked it up, I think it was radiator fluid came out. Then the posi unit kind of broke up. Now he's picking this one up and for the, some reason the control arm f***ed up. Potholes in Houston don't play. What you gotta say to the blog? Okay, well my truck is connecting up. That's uh, steering assistant and the dude's driving here. Not Do you have the brake on? No. no. You're probably gonna have to um, take the battery, take the... Oh, you're gonna probably have to take off the battery post, bro. You reset it. Damn, you that's aching so? también, man. Yeah, I still have to change the gasket, change the gasket for the uh, injector. That thing keeps oh, coming off. Okay. I would reset it. Just take up the battery, um, the battery post for like. But don't fun. I? Aren't I gonna reset the? No, nah, no. Nah. That's just resetting the electrical. You know, the CBS is on too. All that happened when we just picked it up. That's it. Yeah. It's probably because we had it. You had it off, and we was just running. Just reset it. Yeah, just so reset it because since we pulled it, you know, and there's all electrical. Yeah. That's him right there. What? Yeah. Oh, there you go. You got the parts? Yeah, they're inside. Hell yeah. Also gonna bring the C10. I'm gonna go get the notch already oh, from the setup. The setup came through. It's helping out. Huh? How come you have to put it on? Because he has a lot of work right now. So do and I. you're the you're my so do go-to do guy. So do I. You're my go-to guy. So do I. You're the one that you so have to be loyal I. to that. I have a lot of work. You have a lot so of you're gonna have to book an appointment like everybody can. Wow. Damn. So this is the one I had. Okay, so a lot of people keep asking like what drop have. So this is the one I got actually. IHC suspension. 
been having that thing for like four years already. It's the first time that this happens to me. That was a big ass pothole. So they got warranty, right? Lifetime warranty. So something happens, they got me. So yeah, pretty glad to have warranty. So yeah, you have your upper lower control arm, just like the other one, but you have the new one. New so, one? Yeah. What do you mean the new one? This is like their third revision. So you know how yours were all gray? Yeah. Now they come powder coated. Uh, oh gray. damn! Yeah. Things happen for a reason. The new new stuff. I got the new new stuff. Damn. So God knows what he's doing because looks like I broke it just on time. <laughs> I wouldn't say you broke it, Omar. This is a warranty job. <laughs> it broke by itself. <laughs> all right, guys. So I'm gonna work on it tomorrow, and hopefully we can get some good shots. Hey, uh, you still have the parts for the front end for the C nuts? For, 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 I mean, for, for the C ten. Yeah, right there in the corner. For the C10, so I can. Uh, no, um, do you want to do it? Cause you're gonna do that. Well, we're gonna do a C notch on the C10. Do you want to do that? I can do the C notch, but yeah, it's gonna have to be like a day that I'm not busy. Okay. It's definitely gonna take time. Yeah. You know what? Cause I need to get it done fast, so um, I'll just do it at exclusive. I get it done there. I mean. Do it there. You got you got somebody that welds over there? Uh, yeah. No, I mean I'm a welder, so I'll probably weld it. Myself. Huh? That's what I'm saying. Yeah. You just gotta cut it and fit it and that's it. Yeah. That's the only thing that I'm like, eh, fitting it, cutting it, it's new to me, so probably learn on the, yeah, on the way. Fitting and that's the section where you're gonna center it and then you just draw it out, cut it out, and that's it. All right, well, I'll come back tomorrow. Appreciate um, it, man. You're taking off with them or what? Yeah. I was about to get one of these before I got Little Blue. I like your interior. Thank you for making me feel like I'm at home. Yeah, this is pretty cool. So John John is gonna be following us. We're gonna be taking this truck to... We're taking it somewhere. To the AC guy or something. I think that's what Orlando said. John John Come on Come on buddy Alright here we go That was pretty fun Damn this It feels good honestly This truck feels so good right now We're in What? The AC guy But he's not there so. He's not there so yeah, what? I'm just gonna leave it here Right here? Yeah oh, Okay Man this suspension is good What suspension Besides, see, it's the same. Shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I but feel freaking good but in this, this thing. For this body style. Yeah, this thing feels good. And you basically have the seats, like from here. Yeah, feels good, honestly. So we're gonna leave it here. Yeah. All right, guys. So, well, there's nothing going on right now, so we're gonna end it right here. Uh, catch us tomorrow. Tomorrow's vlog. I'm trying to. I'm gonna try to do daily vlogs. I'm not gonna be too hardly edited. Yeah, I gotta lift up the. Windows. The windows. Oh, they're Jingle. automatic. They're automatic. Yeah. I mean, they're they're roll-ups. <laughs> <laughs>